Hey gang, welcome back to Lonely Pines. As ever, always, at the moment, we're riding one of these trains out. Why? Because thanks to Carlos in the last comments in the last episode, we now have train 64 named the Guacamole Express. I'm going to be politically correct here uh, when it comes to guacamole and say if you call it anything else other than guacamole, you're wrong. <laughs> No, in all honesty, that's how I, that's how we've always said guacamole, so I, I don't know if I'm right or wrong, that's just how I've always said it. Uh, I don't know if people call it guacamole, uh, I feel like that's wrong, it doesn't roll off my tongue very well. Anyway, uh, we can have an argument or discussion about it, whatever you like, I'm not going to argue about it, but so we can have a discussion about what we call guacamole or guacamole, I don't know what you call it, but that's, uh, that's the train 64. And a uh, very good name. So thank you very much, Carlos, for that suggestion. That means there is only one train left in the set. Train 65. And there's the names of them there. So if you want to get on board. Uh, now, when these trains eventually probably will get an upgrade as well, they're going to keep their names. So don't worry about that. These trains will forever be known as the trains that they are. Okay. Thank you very much for that. Uh, what else is happening today? We're going to continue on with phase three of the uh, port up at Townsville. It's, there's a bit of work to do with the truck stops. We're going to have to do some truck upgrades as well. Um, we're going to have to do some line management. And um, I get to show off now. I've done a little bit, of, little bit of painting around here too. You can see how it sort of comes out a little bit. A bit nicer, don't you think? Much nicer. <laughs> Much nicer, him. Yeah, thanks, guys. I thought so, too. Yeah, so we're going to check that out uh, and some of the decorating that I've done up there as well. All right. I don't think we need to chitter-chatter about it too much. A little bit of work to do around here as well, around this mountain area. Let's do it. Okay, so here we are up at Townsville. Look at all the work I've done on the docks. No, if anyone follows the community posts, which I do put up and I've put up a sort of a semi-schedule for this week as well, letting you know what's going to be coming this week. Um, so make sure you check that out as well because it keeps you, keeps you guys up to date with what's going on with the channel. But uh, I started making a bit of a keyway around here and especially going under the bridges. I don't know if these uh, are going to get a, a change up at some point, but Chris Fowler... Thank you also for your suggestions when it comes to um, the, uh, what am I saying? The bridges and so forth. So thank you very much. I had seen uh, the Colonel actually put this bridge. I, I did go and do a bit of shopping, but he actually put this bridge. Uh, well, it looks like this one kind of thing in his, uh, in his playthrough. Uh, I stopped by to check that out. And this is an animated bridge, right? So when it goes in, the middle section does lift up when ships and stuff go underneath it. Uh, pretty cool, pretty cool mod if you want, and you've got options like this where they flap open. Unfortunately though, it's only for rail, um, so I, it's, it's going to be no good for this sort of this key, this um, causeway we've got going on here, which I actually really like the causeway. I like its height, its shape, and everything. Oops, there's a bit of a spoiler for you guys to see some of this work. I've started put, setting up a bit of a key around here as well. Started putting some ship assets in, uh, you know, like. Uh, um, Port tugboats and uh, so forth, so on and so forth. We're going to be working over here today to do a bit of work around here. But yeah, just to let you know, I do listen to you uh, and the suggestions. I do listen. And I went shopping and I bought a bridge. You know, this we may end up having to replace this this rail bridge anyway at some point, and this road bridge. Uh, we might have to do something different with this road. Uh, put in a rail bridge that lets bigger ships through and under. All right, let's look at the rest of it. Wow, look at how it's coming along. Okay, it's not even finished yet. That's the good thing. So I've actually just got a uh, pretend little dock section out here for sh shipping container section, you know. Like we've got a warehouse here. There's some trucks sort of parked in. Uh, not finished yet. Semi-fenced off. We've got shipping containers here that get craned up. Look at the cranes working right now. Right, and it loads up the ships. La -di -da -di -da. And then we've got some little sort of boat sections here. I, I sort of hand put together the fences and the stonework. And you've got a bit of like mossy rocks work going on here. This is like a, a, a call out to the old section of the island. We're gonna, I'm going to do up a little bit more. Almost like a bit of a tourist section where tourist buses will be able to come down and 
Um, it's like the old lighthouse on the island with the house as well. So I'll do a little bit more work in for that. Almost like it's sort of heritage listed, so it's untouched. Whereas the rest of the island is sort of a bit more uh, set up for the work and the factory and stuff. You've got a couple of crane guys down here uh, ready for working. More cranes and things over here. Another ship just parked in here. Some factories. So you can see it all starting to come along. Another ship just parked in here. Uh, more guys working. A couple of, a couple of guys just carrying a steel beam for some reason. I think they're just slacking off. A uh, bit of an office building. Some tugboats in and around. So it's, you can see it just starts to pop. It starts to bring a bit of color. A bit of like life to the dock and harbour area and we're going to employ a lot more of that over and around here once we get this truck stop sorted out today as well okay so i just wanted to bring that up uh bring up the speed with what's going on there we'll stop here and have a bit of a look lots of cranes and things around i tried to employ little shacks like where workers go to you know the, the crane driver goes down and hangs out in between i don't know doing his lifting <laughs> That sort of stuff, okay? Probably have to get some cars down, parked down here, like the office cars and stuff like that. Uh, but the trucks, uh, truck stops are usable. They do work. Uh, so, yeah, very handy to know. Okay, so I might actually even reroute. It would be a longer drive, but I actually might reroute some trucks that come down here just to look like it's a bit, a bit more utilized. All right, so we've got these ships just here, these grain ones that are coming in. And I'm actually probably going to switch them to come in, like, over here. Manage the line. Because at the moment, everything's just coming into the one dock. So we can just start off, I think, by switching a few things up. Let's have you come to Townsville Port at... Did I not put a... Now, where are you at? Where's number one? Number one's there. Where's number eight? Number eight's there. Well, you're not going to go there. So maybe number seven. Uh, is it because I've got everything turned off that I can't see the numbers? Six. Six is there. Five. <laughs> Five is on the end. We'll get to the one that I want eventually. Four. Three. Don't tell me it's two. Oh my gosh. It was... It was two. I went one, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, the last one. Okay, so that's where these guys are going to come in now. So the grain has moved there. Perfect. Uh, which is perfect because this is going to be excellent for little ships to go in and under over to that way. The bigger ships that come from that way are going to come up and through here and pull in. And they can just go back that way. But I think you'll agree this, this is a much better setup and system. Okay, were you just a bit confused then, buddy? I'm sorry if I did that to you. Uh, we might even upgrade these ships to be something a little bit bigger, better, and different also. Um, I want to see. Yep, okay, that works. Groovy. Next one on the dock. We've got, uh, what's this one? This, no, we want, um, goods. Okay, let's manage that line. I think maybe we'll send these ones over to here. So, uh, that, manage the line. We'll send you guys, what number was it? Was it, um, that's Windora. Uh, was it five? No, it's going to take me a bit to remember which, who's who in the zoo. No, I don't want seven there. I want you to come on this end one. <laughs> That's one. Oh, I am, you muppet. Where's eight? Eight's there. Okay, eight is on that end. All right, I might need to have to make a mental note. I don't know why my numbers aren't coming up. Probably because I've made such a confusing thing. Right, so that's where the good ships will come into. Lovely. Uh, and then we've just got the crude one. So the crude one can actually probably stay there, to be honest. Uh, you probably would have, like, if you had an oiler wharf, you probably would have it the furthest away from the rest of them. Does it matter? Doesn't matter. We could bring it in here and really, like, 
amp things up a little bit in here, make it look really like this place gets used a lot. Then you have to bring your trucks over here. Okay, now leave it now. We've got that set around. We've got plenty of other docks so for other stuff. Let's have a look at what's going on down here now. Can we put another couple of warehouses in somewhere? Oh, we can put plenty in. Okay, we can have one here, definitely. It'd be lovely if we could put one there. We can go on there. Mm, would have been good sort of every second one, wouldn't it? I think we'll leave it. We'll, we might actually just set... These all the way along here now. Oh, it's going to take a bit, isn't it? You don't... For some reason, when you're doing uh, uh, dock modifications on the map, it just has to take a while to think about it. It's probably the slowest thing to do on the map is, is dock work like this. This will give us... Having these in actually gives you connection to things. So we're going to put our truck stop actually in this area. Okay, we're obviously having trouble with land under here. Okay. Just bring the land so it's... Try that. No, I still didn't want to bar of it. Um, hmm, try again. Give me my water, thanks, so I can see what's going on. That might help it. You can just see it sort of fluffing out a little bit there now. Okay, see how that goes. If not, it's not it's not a big deal. No, okay, it's not like it's it's not liking something. That's no big deal. We've got this bit to utilize anyway, and we can paint the rest if we need to. Um do you want to put a little bit up there? Ah, unless we've got too many, it's saying it outside of dock navigable water. Yeah, you realize though you okay. I'm just gonna leave it. It's gonna fight me. Right, truck stops. What are we gonna do down here? Well, I would like to put a huge big mungus one in. Like I'd love to have this in here. Unfortunately, this truck stop doesn't have massive amounts of capacity. I don't know if that matters too much. I'll tell you what, it fits there, perfect, but do you want it really just there? You might have to do a little bit of pause work here for a second. Actually, I might have to reroute these trucks over to here. While we wait, okay, first things first. Manage the vehicles. We've got four of these old tankers on here. We're going to replace them now with... Uh, give me some sort of tanker variant. Oh, yeah, what do we got here? Oh, okay. Well, I go. I guess I, I want two shell. Did we, did they just get replaced? Oh, we're auto saving. Bloody auto save! And then we're going to replace these two with the uh, BP ones. Okay. Lovely. A couple of BP and a couple of shell ones. Right, what are these trucks here? Manage these ones, okay. Oh jeez, there's some noisy cars outside today. Alright, this one will get uh, uh, we'll get an arrow one. Or two. Alright, these two we will get. Uh, I don't mind if they kind of run at a loss for a little bit. Everything's going to get ramped up soon, so I'm not too worried about that. Place those with those two. Because uh, uh, all the trains will be ramped up. All the ships are going to be ramped up. Uh, and we'll get the uh, Traveco ones. Okay. Good little mix-up of uh, different sorts of trucks going on there. Now, uh, having said that, we're going to manage the line and get you guys to now... Hmm. So you're bringing in... What? 
heaps of uh, crude. Oh, refined, is it? No, it's refined. Okay, anyway. Manage the lion ham. We're going to send you guys over to here, actually. Uh, Upper Townsville. Which one is which? That's Upper Townsville. I'll have you come to here, and we'll get rid of Upper Townsville. And you're just taking crude. Okay, so... Just taking crude. Oh, it's funny, it's got Gold Coast Transfer. Uh, we'll rename all that later, I think. But So I just want to make sure you're good, good. You can go. Okay, so that means all that should get put over here now. I hope. Oh, and look, every time we do a, a weird load thing, it, it loads thing. So it's got a weird, there's a weird sort of bug going on at the moment with the uh, the loading. If I just do this, there we go. Okay, you get, you get, if you ever have like a weird bug where the, uh, the land looks like it drops or sinks or whatever, just pull out your leveling thing, click on it, and it will, uh, it will readjust it and fix it up. I didn't stuff up my, no, this is my little fuel area in here caged off. Okay, lovely. So those trucks should now come over the bridge and far away, do da, do da. Alright, lovely, lovely. Is he actually bringing, I just want to make sure I haven't broken anything here. Actually not bringing anything down. You should be just heading that way and taking. Oh, okay, whatever. And then you guys are also going to be... Manage the line. Ah. Okay. If that's a... Have I got something totally mixed up on here? If that's goods truck... Why have we got tankers on it? Why did I have tankers on it before if it's just goods? When you're clearly not just goods. Okay, we've got a bit of work to do there. Okay, just manage the line and get it shifted over to here anyway, please. Um, that station. And what's that one? Lower Townsville. Get rid of Lower Townsville. Okay. And then at uh, this transfer, you can give it a two. All right, we've got some uh, work to do there because that should not... Be, that should... Those trucks aren't right. They're taking fuel and goods, they should be, if they're going to be doing that. And I'm pretty sure they're not supposed to be taking fuel at all, but they've just changed that. So we're going to manage those vehicles again. And we're actually going to replace them with things like this. Let's get a couple of these. Okay, replace them with... Um, yep, these guys. Do these guys take goods and... No, they don't... Oh, bugger. I need trucks that take all, please. Bagger on toast. Okay. I'll need to look at some mods for that. They should be taking a um, bit of everything. Right, and then there's nothing there. And then there's just the grain trucks, which we might be able to replace these grain trucks as well now. Unless we've already done that. Looks like we are utilizing the man dump truck, which they're pretty good. I don't think we need to change those up. All right, they're the man. All right, they can get shifted as well. All right, a bit confusing because that's half these things I haven't touched in a while. But uh, anyway, we'll send these guys right around here, I think. Uh, that will be Upper Townsville. Okay, so hopefully that doesn't mess up out. Let's just hit the turbo jets for a moment here. Let's turn down. We, we don't want to hit 2000s yet. We get some more cars. Lovely. Let's just make sure that we're not... Uh, these are going to work. A 
because it's it's sort of untried, untested. I don't know if our drop off is going to actually work here for the moment. So I just want to make sure that is working. We haven't completely broken everything. Okay. Right, where's that grain? Grain should be coming in now. Nope. Oh, here we go. Grain is coming in. Whew, lucky. Over here. Uh oh, spaghetti. Have we broken this? All signs point to we might have, we might have broken this by putting these trucks over here. Where are you picking up your grain from? Down this way. Ah, oh, you're still supplying. Okay. There we are. They just didn't, maybe I just, because I diverted the trucks. Oh yeah, no, okay, we're good, we're good. Maybe because I diverted the trucks that were already dropping off here to come here before they went off again. Okay, I think that's what it was. Yeah, 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 we're all good, we're all good, we're all good, G. Okay, and you just dropped off what? Goodness knows what. Uh, to goodness knows where. Somehow I don't think we're getting goods up here. We need to look into that later. Okay, that's a job for later. Right now, this is going. Sorry, it's so confusing. It's so hard to wrap my head around what's actually going on these days again uh, with old stuff. Uh, but it's it's going to need to be done. Right, you can go. What is going on here? Configure. Yeah, I'm well aware you're outside of navigatable waters. I want to get... What is going on with this? It's because of this stuff going on here, I think. You don't... I don't know if anyone's given you the memo. You don't actually need to be inside navigatable waters for you to actually work. Okay. Champ. I think it has something to do with over here as well, though. We've kind of... We've kind of... Um, the game's gone, oh, I, don't know, I can't compute, that's not right. We're going to leave that in, we'll paint it in. It's not. It's just not playing the game. Right, we're going to get our truck stop road here. I kind of want a big double lane banger. But, in the meantime... Oh, good, it still looks alright. How do we want to run our truck stop now? This is the question, gang. This episode was always going to be very fiddly, so I do apologize if it's hard to follow along with what's going on at the moment, but it was always going to be a really fiddly episode. Um, in terms of uh, where things were going to go and, and the line management and stuff, because I knew it was going to be a little bit confusing straight off the bat. I think that just fits in there perfect. Okay, we're going to put that in there. It just looks like it's meant to go there. Like it was just a perfect fit. Okay, which it is. And then we're also going to put in a regular truck stop. So we can have some buildings around it. But, we're going to put it in. Ooh, give me the road. Give me the truck stop road like that. And big lanes, big lanes. Uh, okay, that's acceptable. I'll take that. And you can switch to single. I like these little, um, Roads with the truck stops on the side. It makes it 
uh, seem a little bit more industrial. Right, can we actually just get a thing attached to that? Um, how do you feel about that? Juicy. And then, you're going to have a little bit of trouble connecting that to there though, aren't you? Nope, not at all. That's bloody perfect, because, and that's joined up nicely. Don't you like when sometimes things just work? Because, oh yes, give it to me. Right? Because reasons. Yep. Nope. That's not a thing. Take that one out. I don't want that. Okay. Don't do that again. Just leave it ham. That's enough. That's plenty of truck stopping. It is, isn't it? Okay. That is plenty of truck stopping. Now, you've got trucks that come in over the bridge down here. Do they want to have a lure? No, no, send them on the roundabout. That's what it's for. Are we happy with that? Kind of. And then, well, this bit here, where you've got this stuff, can get painted in. Oh yeah, buddy, you tell us. Uh, is it that one? Yes, it is. So paint that in all the way. Although it's a nice little grass sort of strip down there. No, I'm going to industrialize it all. Okay, we're going to have trucks parked in and around here. This is a docks. No time for grass. Okay. In here. Just in there. Clear out those two rocks. Oops. And then I can put some buildings in there where it's kind of dipped away. Unless I can... Hmm. No, I can't because that's the actual... Yeah, okay. I'll leave it. We can do something with, uh, with a wall or something. Or, or a fence. Actually, that's a good idea. Compound fence. Kind of like this. Alright. Fenced off and we'll put some stuff in there. Right, like that. Same on this side, line. Um, yeah, yeah, fence it. Right, kind of like it's just for this compound here. We can park some stuff in it, put some buildings in and around there. Oh, it'll come up beautiful, okay? All of a sudden, it, we're just getting this nice sort of docks, industrial, big open sort of feel. Love it. Okay, that, that's a that's a great shot, actually. Let's get a screenshot of that, shall we? Oh, yep. Okay, screenshots away. Um, what now? Well, you kind of need to paint that one up a little bit too, don't you? But just... Don't worry about that at the moment. Let's get our, tr let's get our grain trucks back over here. Manage these vehicles, please. Uh, no, manage the line. Right, so, uh, hump, hump de do. Oh yeah, I was gonna say, that's, the <laughs> they're coming from hump de do. I was like, that's Townsville Annex. I love how that's Gold Coast and that's Townsville Annex. Oh dear, right, so at hump de do, you're gonna add this station. We'll go into here and then we'll get rid of Townsville Annex. Gone, okay, that's cool. Because they're just doing a drop-off. So that's perfect. This can be just a drop-off bay, I reckon. Right? What next? Well, we don't need all the trucks going in here. Ah, oh, see, it's done that dip thing again. Yeah. Yep, seen. Seen. Okay. Right. Uh, take these ones. And send them back to here. This one. 
because they're going to be picking up products as well. So I want products to be able to be stored in here and there'll be more storage space on that one. So go so out there, add station there and get rid of Gold Coast. Okay. But I am going to leave the, the other tankers to drop in here. Okay. Right. That's good. We're getting along. We're getting there. I think it's coming along very swimmingly, actually. Oh man, that what a my what a brain teaser for a Monday morning. I think that's looking a heck of a lot better though. And then what we want to do here now is I'm actually gonna do something like this. I'm gonna get this tool, flatten it all the way up to there where I can. Right up under here. Okay. And then we're going to do a little bit of um, retaining manipulation. I kind of would like to have a sneaky road come in here from that way though, but I don't need to. Alright, give me the walls. Okay, we're going to go... Uh, we're going to stick with our Besser block because we've got them here. Right. Right you are. Give me the 40. Give me at 9. Try 6. Do you want to come kind of... Maybe we just... No, I need you along the bottom here. At 3, I think. 3 is enough for retaining. Okay, so you can come from about there. Give me a slight... If I can keep this all one length. Okay, I think you're right there. Beautiful. Okay, yeah, we're going to do a tiered system here with this wall very shortly. How's that looking? It's looking like it's starting to tip away that way. Up there. Um, not to worry though, I think I'm going to keep it with a little bit of open room. So we'll go like this. Right. Yep. Come back that way. Baby, come back. Do -ba -do -ba -do -ba -ba -ba. Right. I think that's all we need to do for the moment. Probably we can just leave this. Like we could have little stuff stored under here, like the actual. Yeah, actually, we could bridge it up under there. Right. Just here. Okay. Something like that. And then we can actually like store pallets and old stuff up under there. Like an old sort of docks area. And then I don't like how you've got that little bit of lump there. Ah, bugger. You didn't muck up over here, did you? Yes. Every time I get the tool out to work over here, it hates it over here. <laughs> Try to avoid getting it out of the Paint tool. We'll be right. Right. We're going to paint up that to there. Thank you, autosave. You are a winner. I mean, I'd complain if I, if I crashed and I lost all my last work. That then I would really complain. So auto saves kind of like, it's an annoyance, but it's a good annoyance. Okay, what are you gonna do about that tree? Uh, make a little garden feature. That's what I'm gonna do. Okay, no one said it had to be perfect.
And in fact, we might actually go to some sort of gravel. Uh, hmm, how do you want to do that? Uh, give me back this. Take the strength down. Because I want kind of grassy, gravelly area. Yeah. We'll start to get this sort of effect, and then I need some sort of weedy looking stuff if we can, please, as well. Weedy looking stuff, hey, coming right up. Yep. Give me some up under there as well, along the banks. I'll tree the banks up actually. Uh, give me some weedy looking stuff now. Right, like the dry stuff, yeah, like that. Jesus, a bit, of, bit too much strength on that, I think. That's alright. It's kind of like a unkept sort of bit of area, right? Mm, bit, I kind of want it to be a little browner. Yeah, there we go. That's better. Bit of green weeds I don't mind here and there, but uh, otherwise, that'll do that. Okay, perfect. Then, let's get some trees, please. Uh, back to, uh, take it off that. Trees, right? Uh, let's not have these trees. <laughs> Straight up. Don't have those trees. Okay, what trees do you want, Ham? Well... Ooh... We might have to put them in by hand, I think. Also, that's uh, those trees are no good. They're gonna cause havoc with your yeah, uh, ground textures. Yeah. Okay. Give me something smaller then, if you can. No. Just don't put them in all the way. Some ground texture I don't mind being destroyed, but I like I would like give me a little bit of the gravel if you can. See if that works. Yeah, I kind of don't mind that. Okay. Sort of half gravel then, dirty. Like it's a bit of old area. Give me the, there's crack stuff here, isn't there too? Which one's the cracked looking one? I don't know, but that's probably a pretty good blend there. I think I'll leave that. All right. That's our sort of working area, and then what we can do is fence a lot of this off as well. So then we'll go these fences, but we'll go um, the one with barbed wire at the top. Like that. Okay. Oh yeah, this is good. Okay. Like that. Bring it down to like there. Uh, leave that. Finish that there. Right? Because this is all going to be, like you said before, all sort of um, docked up with stuff and things and stuff. 
stuff that looks old, like barrels and old stuff like that uh, uh, just got stored there and never got, like, sorted out. It just forever stayed there. Give me some curb. Give me some curb herb. Okay, we'll just do that for a bit. Lovely. Okay, we start to get a little bit of like, uh, um, keep out. Keep out. We need a big sort of dock sign. That's what we need. Where are those flags? Where do you keep those? Oh, I keep them in a secret place. Are they just here somewhere? Probably. Um,. Ooh, they're not bad. You can put in a couple of these along the docks. They sort of start to look a bit good, you know? So you put them, like, here. One there. One there. Okay. Ah, uh, where are the flags, Ham? Don't know can't help you. I'd love to put this in. It's just a little impractical, isn't it? Yeah, it's just a little bit of overkill at the moment for what we've got. However, these are not. Uh, your land's a bit high there. You know that, right? Yeah, we can fix that. <laughs> by getting out the leveling the terrain tool uh, that crane, no that's alright Starting to sort that out a little bit too. Maybe I can paint up some of that too. Okay. Fix this. Right. Well, that's coming along handsomely. Uh, what about the ends here? Yeah, not too keen on the ends, are we? That's dirty water. It's coal. Yeah, just give it that for the moment. Until you figure out what you're going to do there. I think just give it that. Get it around the back here too. It's just had a half hazard uh, asphalt job. But I actually might put a little bit more of that dock decking in there. Alright, oh, we've got a good mix here of stuff now. But we don't have goods. So I don't know why you're labelled goods when you're not actually doing goods. Okay, and these guys are dropping off here. That's perfect. And our tankers, our tankers will be coming down here. Are they actually bringing anything? Nope. He's taking some, so it is actually working. Just very, very slowly. Uh, so that means two things. We need to ramp up ships, and we need to ramp up the trains for that. We're going to look into that next time out, actually. We, we might start really fixing up all of this, uh, uh, the line management and the shipping of stuff. Uh, and I think that's going to be next episode. So thanks for joining me today, gang. I know it was a very sort of heavy um, understanding with what the lines were doing again as well. But hey, this is a heck of a lot better. More of this to sort of get put in and around. Uh, it'll probably end up a lot like this over here. Just stuff everywhere. Yeah, that's, what it, that's sort of like... I've worked in and around a lot of docks. Uh, for a long time, especially with the Navy and stuff, and, and you do end up with a lot of, like, buildings, logistic buildings here, there, and everywhere, and, and sort of uh, cargo sections and cranes, and uh, so I've seen plenty of ports and pulled into plenty around the world, uh, and we'll make it look very nice and busy, but I think that's coming along really well. This, this has just made me so much happier, the way this has uh, sort of turned out. 
that maybe that's a better photo. Oh yeah, let's get a pause. Let's get a picture of that. I don't know if that'll be the screenshot for the <laughs> for the title page, but if it is, you know where it came from. Right, what are we going to write out today? Oh, I don't know. Actually, I do know. Oh, let's write a tr let's write one of our tanker trucks. Uh, where is the tanker trucks? Look at all these lines and half of them probably not doing anything anymore. Yeah, is it that one? It is that one. We'll wait for a truck to come through here, but I've been Van Ham. Thanks for joining me today. I'm off to the farm now to do a bit of farm work, and then I'm off to northern Siberia where it's freezing cold where we're trying to survive. So I've got a busy day ahead of me, uh, but uh, stay tuned for some more Transport Fever uh, with Spring Update series, more Lonely Pines, and plenty more to come on the channel. Gang, leave a like, comment, subscribe, and hit the bell notification for more content. Your subscriptions and likes do go a long way, and we're trying to push towards that ever elusive thousand marks so if you're hanging around um just tick that tick that box hit that big red button and uh it'll help us all out uh remember stay up to date with stuff in the community posts that i put on the channel as well uh, there's plenty of stuff getting put up in there you can check out what's going on with the channel and what's coming up as well uh can we have that tank you know what employ a bit of fast forward ham and then one will come in uh, yeah, you say that, but uh, will it or won't it? Well, it will. You just have to employ the fast forward button. Um, yeah, we'll do this little truck ride along. I think it'll be quite nice. Surely there's one on the way. There can't be four trucks just hanging out. Uh, oh, there's one. We'll ride it all the way in the loop, all the way back to here. Oh, we're on. We're on board a BP truck, by the way. Don't mind the jittery, uh, jittery paintwork there. Right, okay, how do you want to do this? Well, you're probably going to hit... Hit that thing right there. Let's hit play. Uh, we'll be okay. We'll be okay like that. Oh, look, it's filling up under the pipework. Lovely. Okay, get out of here, Ham. Yep, sorry. See you guys very soon in the next one. Bye for now.